Okay, today we are going to move on to the fifth and final lesson of this unit. Um, so, today we are going to talk about reversible and non-reversible changes. So, um, basically what a reversible change is something you can change an object, and then if you want you can change it back. Um, a non-reversible change is you can change an object but it's impossible to change it back so um, pretty basic thing um, we'll get into it more deeply with some examples and an example of a reversible change um, would be the melting of ice um, basically you have an ice cube it can melt into water you can take that water and freeze it again so it went from it ice to water back to ice you changed it exactly how it was before um, another example um, blowing up of a balloon so uh, you can blow up a balloon and then so it's changed it's changed to size and then you let the air go and it's back to the same size so you change the size it was small, you changed the size, made it back to small, you changed it back, it was a reversible change. Another example would be um, dissolving of salt into water. So I have a cup of water, pour a bunch of salt into it, um, and then I could use um, a dripper to get all of the salt out if I want. Um, these are all examples of reversible changes, so you basically just have to think, can I take it back what I did? Um, some examples of non-reversible changes. So basically, whenever I think of a non-reversible change, I think of like fire, explosions, burning, rotting, things like that. Um, I have an exciting, cool example. I, got, I actually got two cool, exciting examples. Uh, a video of a reversible change and a video of a non-reversible change. I am in the non-reversible change video. Um, but, um, basically like an explosion, so, um, you'll see that in the video that I'm going to show you. Uh, rotting, so the rotting of an apple. You cannot turn it back into a good, normal apple. Um, so, burning, so a log set on fire you can't turn it back into the log it was before I'm cooking so I'm cooking eggs I can't turn it back to um, this egg before the way it was before it's just not gonna happen it's um, not possible um, also we were talking about blowing a balloon up if you pop that balloon it is irreversible. You can't turn it back into the way it was. That's a non exa another example of a non-reversible change. Um, so that's basically everything I wanted to go over here. Uh, you with for reversible and non-reversible changes. Um, I hope you understood it. There are now multiple choice questions that you have to go over about reversible non reversible and non-reversible changes basically it'll state something and you click either reversible or non-reversible um, I believe there's a question too and I would also like you to send me a picture of not both just one um, example of a reversible or non-reversible change and you have to tell me whether this change was reversible or non-reversible and my email and everything is located at the bottom of the page should be fairly easy to send it to me. Um, I think that's about it. Any questions, email me. And this is the end of the online questions that I'm doing for you. So I hope this worked well for you and I hope you understood and enjoyed it. Thank you.